I'm going to talk about how to deal with your child's phobias. Um, now phobias we always think about maybe as an adult being, I'm scared of heights um, or I have a phobia or fear of elevators. Well children can actually develop phobias as well and it's when their anxiety or fears are extreme and what happens with a phobia is when you're so worried about something you avoid it. Um, it becomes something that you're phobic about so you don't want to go near it. And what happens is sometimes you have a reaction um, that signals there's something terrible that's going to happen. Your body gets into this state of hyper-awareness or um, your heart is racing or your palms are getting sweaty or you're breathing fast. And when that happens, your body is saying, oh, something dangerous is going on or something dangerous is happening or out there. And the reality is, it's not. And so your body is overreacting in some ways. And sometimes your mind is then also saying, this is dangerous, this is terrible, something bad will happen. Um, now sometimes kids outgrow phobias. Sometimes what will happen is kids will become so scared of something that they avoid it or they avoid things related to it or they avoid situations where they might be near it. Um, maybe it's bugs or spiders um, or maybe it's cartoon characters or clowns. Um, but what happens when it's a problem is that it interferes with their life. And so they're not going places because they're afraid that they'll interact with whatever that thing is. Um, and when that happens, you need to sometimes get professional help to figure out a way to gradually help that child um, be around or with or exposed to the thing that they're scared of, learn how to control their thoughts and their feelings, and then they will find out that it's not so scary. Um, and that they, in fact, can manage their fears um, and they won't have to avoid different things and they can live a much fuller life.